Hey guys, and welcome to Monday. So I have three tests this week. I have medical terminology today in about mm, 10 minutes. I'm not really worried about it. I study really hard for those. On Tuesday, I have a lab for anatomy, which I'm not prepared for um, at all. And then Thursday, I have anatomy lecture test, which I'm also not prepared for. Um, <gasps> So it's going to be a really horrible and stressful week. And I also have math homework that I haven't finished either. And I have to go to a wedding on Thursday. So stay tuned. i and I have my test at 10 o'clock. Um, if you want to see my, how stressed I am, here's my disgusting pile of mess. So I'm going to head inside and go to the test room. Um, took my test, didn't do as well as I thought I was gonna do, was actually kind of shocked. I misspelled, and I missed like, cause spelling counted, I missed like five words that I knew. I wrote them like a hundred times, but I was trying to rush and never do that. I was confident and I got slapped in the face. I still made a high B, so that's still good, but I made a hundred last time, so I wanna go get some Starbucks and cry in the cup. So I got my coffee. It was a, it was like a, a nut house in there. People were being really rude, and they were so slow, and they got orders mixed up. And I'm like stressed out because I was trying to park here, and this guy like almost hit me three times trying to rush out of here. Like it's a busy, like, this parking lot is usually congested. Like where, where are you going? Like running around. Anyway, so I got a, got a venti coffee. I always get um, sugar free cinnamon dolce a syrup and then almond milk because I can't drink real milk so I'm going to go to the library and study now it's only Monday it's only Monday guys oh. here's the damage I have a lab quiz tomorrow and the spelling counts so I'm trying to um this is what really helps me study is I put my like uh, diagram inside of a sheet protector and I take a you know like a whiteboard marker and I just write it over and over until I I know like epidermis and dermis and hypodermis and all that good stuff I write over and over and I think this is this really helps me to learn like diagrams for anatomy so I thought I would share that tip with you. Night soon, I study better in the morning, so I just go to sleep at like um like nine, and I wake up at five, and then I cram in the morning. I'm just I'm better in the morning and night. I, I like my sleep, guys. So I'll just check in with y'all tomorrow. Hey. Bye. Good morning. It is Tuesday. It is about six thirty a.m. I think. Um, I've already done my makeup. I wanted to tell you about this foundation. This foundation is amazing it is as you can see hold on yeah enus free inus free when i lived in china i was dating this guy in korea and he always made fun of me of how i said this um but i'm 2.3 and it is i mean it's beautiful i love this i only wear it on like special occasions when i'm trying to seam away you know what i mean um so i love it it's flawless they have great everything great skincare this is not sponsored hashtag wish it was because i live for this brand um so i'm gonna go study my lab i'll take you guys with me to lab and anatomy today so follow along on my journey of stress Look at this. Look at it. Look at the. That's right here represents the cartilage. 
the cartilage that attaches to the 12 pairs of ribs. So your ribs, you have 12 pairs of ribs, and you have seven. Yeah, I'm trying to make sure the age is it starts to lose the melanin. Hey guys, I'm sorry I didn't update after the anatomy class. I was just so tired. After the, that two hour lecture, the last thing I want to do is talk. I just went in my car, went straight home, and ate some lunch. Uh, if you guys are interested in what I eat, like let me know down below. I just don't film it. I don't think it's that, that important. Um, so right now I'm just studying some medical term. I have that tomorrow morning, which I will film for once. Um, so I'll see you guys then. Good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, about 7.30, I think, in the morning. Um, I have a massive lecture test today, which I'm kind of on the fence about. I kind of know it, but I'm sorry about Wednesday. Everything got canceled on Wednesday because of bad weather, so sorry there's no medical term. I know I told y'all I was going to show you, but um, I'll take y'all lab again. and. Uh, deal with this um, lecture test, so see you soon. And it's usually referring to the palm. Palms up or palms down. So that finished, that's a real short one of doing the joint. Let's do the muscles. Hey guys, I just finished my anatomy test and it was so hard. So I'm out here um, rethinking my life and my purpose for a while. You're starting to see all of the bones. So very early, you would say you're probably around 10 weeks at this point. And I'm not have my weeks off because it doesn't say exactly what we did. But you can see the skull. If you see the little pieces of yellow, that is going to be the remnants of what's left here. So that started out as the fibrous connective tissue. Hey guys, so I just got my test result from my anatomy test and I just want to show you our class average. I didn't fail, thank God, but this is our class average, a 63.9, oh my God. I mean, this poor soul right here, this poor soul, they made between a zero and a five but I was in this percentile. Yay, me. So I didn't fail, but 69, 63, excuse me, 63. That's crazy. So um, now I'm just going to um, catch up for the next week. I have to go to a wedding tomorrow, and I won't be back till Saturday night. So I'm trying to, you know, <laughs> get some work done. So that was it. That was my week. If you guys like it, leave a like and a comment. Let me know what you think. What would you like to see? Tell me you hate me. Whatever. Just let me know. Bye.